morning and welcome to today's upload. My name's Emma. Stick around for hauls and vlogs. I am here with this one, my big girl. She asked to be in this video. This is Erin. She's 11 and she is about to start secondary school. And today, I just said to her, I might embarrass you because I'm going to sing a song. If you are new here, you won't know this song. If you are old here, you will know this song. And it is a song I will do again at some point soon when I do a Poundland haul. <clears throat> Stationery, stationery, I really, really, really love stationery. <laughs> That's the stationery song. If you didn't know it, now you do, and if you did know it, and then you've not heard it for a while, we are doing a stationery haul. Um, we went out to get loads of bits and bobs, so we're going to go through sections. We've divided it up, and we will chat through the stuff that we've got. So I will start, I think. We popped to Tiger, and we went to the big Tiger in the Bullwing, didn't we? Mm -hmm. And we actually made a list. Um, it wasn't the self it was Grand Central. Grand Central. Central. The train station. Yeah. Big Tiger. So we made a list, didn't we, of all the stuff that you thought you needed, and we were ticking things off, and we have gone to Tiger, and we picked up some of these which were five pound and they are Viscar Pavlovanta also known as erasable coloured pencils when I was a kid we had the felt with the white and it would erase them out they still yeah. do those don't they yeah, yeah that was the height of excitement the next thing we got was um just a pack of pencils these were pound it's just a pencil, just a pencil. A pencil. I don't know if you're supposed to have a certain HB or if you need a like what are they called the P mechanical ones. The mechanical pencils. I'm unsure but we got these ones. We picked up a rubber for a pound and we also picked up a sharpener for a pound. She's gone for pink. Yep. And finally this is the first of two pencil cases. She wanted a pencil case. What's going to go in this pencil case? Uh, like the pencils and then the rubbers and the sharpener. So the pencils, the rubber and the sharpener. And the pens. And the pens in this pencil case. But there's two pencil cases. So moving on to Paper Chase. It. <laughs> Fancy shop, what have we got? It was a three for two deal. So got these pens. They're dual end. So they've got like the brush pen and then the normal felt pen. And then so it's three for two and they 20. were how much? They were... Ten pounds. Ten pounds, three for two. Then we've got a calculator. We've got a calculator. We didn't know, I don't know if this is the calculator she will need at some point, but I thought it was quite, a, it was cheaper than where we saw it elsewhere, yeah. wasn't it? So this is an Oxford scientific calculator and that was... Ten pounds. Ten pounds. Recommended for GCSEs. <laughs> Can't believe I'm thinking about GCSEs. Ooh. And then last, this is the second pencil case. We've got this one. I don't know if it's supposed to have like that, that. Yeah, do you want to open it and show the people what's inside? Because these these are our stationery fans. They want to see all the bits. Yeah. I think That's like, like cards. cards. And, and like a clear bit in the middle. And then like um, a pocket there. Yeah. Then, she's very excited to finish this video because then she's just going to spend the afternoon <laughs> filling up all her pencil cases. This was £12. So we got three for two. So the felts or the calculator were free, weren't yeah. they? So that was good. We also popped to the works. The works has some brilliant back to school stuff, doesn't it? Yep. So we um we did it, you know I love a bargain. We did a bit of shopping around. So we saw this set elsewhere for like seven pound. But in the works, not only was it much cheaper, it was three pound. Three pound. But they had lots of nice colours in yeah. the And you've gone for purple, and this is an eco edition math set. So it's got a compass, pencil, ruler, set squares, protractor, eraser, pencil sharpener, and a letter in essential. <laughs> and it's it's ninety six percent recyclable. So I thought that was pretty. What other yeah. colours did they have? They had like uh, I think they had like turquoise, and then they had like one with triangles so that are different colours. Yeah. So we thought that was really cute. And then for a pound, me and Daddy said to Erin yesterday, these rulers have been around since I was a child. Classic shatter resistant. Doesn't mean it's you can't break it. Ah. Uh. You can still break it, it just means if you break it, it's not gonna shatter. So it'll just snap in half rather than be like <laughs> So don't think this is an unbreakable ruler. It's not that pound. 
And then you wanted a little notepad, didn't you? Yeah. So we went for this. And why did you choose this notepad? It's so I can rip them out with the one that has like the without the like flat there, not the circle. You can't really rip the pages out. You just have to be stuck with mistakes in your book. So. Yeah, so she wants to have, you know, you can rip it out rather than more like a book one where they're stuck in forever. Yeah. Lovely. And then we went to the classic. Primark. Primark. So we've got a water bottle. If this, stand up and show your little outfit. This water bottle is what Erin would call her aesthetic. How much was that? That. Um, I think it was six pound or eight yeah, pound I or think something. So. But I thought we thought that was really nice, and you did cheer when you saw that, didn't you? And then, because we're gonna get a new phone, we got a new phone case, which is Care Bears one. It was four pound fifty. So Erin had the first phone she had was my old old oh, old yeah. iPhone. Now she's getting my old, old iPhone, so she's being upgraded. No, your old iPhone. Oh, my old, uh, my old. <laughs> <laughs> she's being upgraded, yeah. but she's just getting my old one. Um, we wanted her to have the old, old one. Are you with us? Are you keeping up with us um, for her first phone in case you broke it and stuff? So, yeah. And you've been all right. There was one <laughs> but smash. It wasn't me. It wasn't her. It got dropped. Yeah. Because at primary school it gets put in a box, doesn't it? And it got mm -hmm. dropped in between. We don't know what happened. But she was alright with it, so you're being upgraded, aren't you? Yeah. So that's a nice new phone case. Um, what else have we got? Pro we got from Amazon. I'm going to tell you a boring story now that Erin has heard. How many times? Like ten times. Like? Over like two days. Ten times over two days. <laughs> Brace yourself for number eleven. <laughs> Three put stick. And you're like Emma. What is the story behind three put stick? We went to Hobbycraft, and mm -hmm. she'll show you some stuff from Hobbycraft. We went to Hobbycraft, and I saw three put sticks, and I thought three put sticks, great for six pound. And I thought six British pounds. So I looked on Amazon, and this was like what two pound thirty five. So I booked, bought them from Amazon, and I left them in Hobbycraft. And there is a lesson out there, which is always check online. The same happened with your bag, hasn't it? Yeah. So show us, pass us that bag there, Erin. Lots of you gave us lots of advice about this bag. And we did wash it, and by we, I obviously met me. And we hung out to dry, and it looks great. But a lot of you said this wasn't going to be big enough. I don't think it would fit that much stuff in it. And as we can see, she's got quite a lot of stuff. So what bag did you decide to go for? Is it Jan Sport or Jan, Jan, Jan Sport? Jan Sport or Jan Sport? And it was in Urban Outfitters for £45. <laughs> so what did I do? Amazon. I looked at Amazon and it was £19. I've also told several people that story as well. So that's coming in the next few days, isn't yeah. it? Last little bit from Hobbycraft. I'll save my favourite. She's going to save the best to last. You go and save the best for last. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> ten packs of blue zebra. Zebra pens. pens. And why do we get zebra pens? Because they're your favourite? Because they're my favourite. I don't let. Anybody ever tell you anything other than a zebra pen is the best pen? Mm -hmm. I think this is two pound. I'm not sure. Four pound. It was a few pounds. Yeah. You can get them in Poundland, you can get them in every shop, but the zebra pens are by far the best. And what happens if you don't have a pen in secondary school? You get a negative point, something like that. Um, or, like, on the system. It's a big deal, so she needs more than one, which is good, because she's got ten. She won't have all ten. You'll put a couple in your bag, won't you, and then we can keep yeah. the rest up here. Okay, and this is the pièce de résistance. Chef's kiss. <gasps> Midliner zebra. Five of them. Five zebra midliner pens. Double-ended highlighter and marker all in one. What a treat, what a dream. Which pencil case are they going to go in? Oh, 
Oh, I don't know. Which one do you think? I don't know. I don't know how you're going to fit all this. Are you going to take all of the felt tips? Or are you just going to take like one orange, one pink, one red, one green? Let us know in the like comments. If you've got a secondary school kids, do they even need felts and crayons? I mean, she's got them now. But these are great. I've actually got a set of these. They do a big set in Costco. Um, I will be going back to Costco soon and we'll be looking for some different types of stationery. But that is it at the moment. We are still waiting for the bag. And we need to find a coat. We have to find a coat. But again, a lot of people are saying their kids don't wear coats. They just wear blazers. Let me know your thoughts, people. Um, but yeah, that is a lot of stuff. I'm actually going to pop out tonight to Sainsbury's as well to look at some other bits and bobs. But I think we've got it all covered. If you think we're missing something, please let us know because you're going to be watching this. And we've still got two weeks before you go back so they can give us some yeah. advice anything else you'd like to say to the people uh, this is your platform hi <laughs> hi would you like me to sing the station song again um <laughs> it pardon is that a yes mm, station no yeah. me station no join in everybody i really 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 love Station. Are you covering your ears? <laughs> there we go, guys. It's a haul. I'm going to be back with a Poundland haul. Um, I'm going to have a look at the... It might not be a haul. It'll be a Poundland come shop with me. Like, have a little mooch around at the stationery there. Because they usually... Were you just singing the song then? No, singing we... Come Shop With Me. Oh, We Need a Come Shop With Me song. What is it? Come um, Shop With Me. I've got her on board, guys. <laughs> I've got her on board. Get us in Eurovision next year. Right, we love you lots. We'll speak to you soon. And um, stationery is the best thing in the world after Disney. Oh, and after my children. Love you, bye. Bye. <laughs>